What we're doing is just basically giving college students an organization, a website, if you will, of their own that can get them together and to compete for prizes, scholarships, and just so they can meet you know, other college students that do this and make friends that just last forever and of course get them into a sport that's going to be a positive impact on their life. The 2013 Sperry Topsider College Kayak Fishing National Championship was held at Everything Kayak in Biloxi, Mississippi. Students from across the southeast came together to compete for prizes and scholarships totaling close to $15,000 and the coveted title of national champion. With lightning in the distance, teams arrive early to prep their kayaks for a 5.30 a.m. launch in the canal behind Everything Kayak. As the sun breaks, Let's catch up with some of the anglers out on the water. All right, so we're here at the Sperry Top Cider College Kayak Fishing National Championships. We're out on the water right now with Stephen F. Austin University's McKenzie. McKenzie, have you had any luck this morning? Uh, two smaller flounder and a few other bites that's it all right so he says he's got two small flounder and a few other bites and that's pretty good with how hard the fishing's been lately so it's still early you got a long way to go mckenzie and uh we wish Stephen up austin the best of luck all right so i'm here with ryan russo from lsu and he tells me that his team's already got a couple red fish and maybe about 45 inches so it seems to be even in these tough conditions the college students are figuring it out just like we knew they would. As the three o'clock deadline approaches, students make their way back to the canal behind Everything Kayak and line up to submit their photos for scoring. All right, so LSU2, you guys are clearly the most spirited group out here with the matching shirts or whatever. I mean, how'd it go out there? What, what was your experience the very first Ferry Topsider College Kayak Fishing National Championship? Uh, a lot to it say. was a blast. It was a lot of fun out there. Um, we got out there in the morning, they were hitting a little bit. Uh, the reds were moving. You could see them uh, in the marsh. Any good stories from today? What was. Uh, no, I lost one at the boat. But oh, man. Yeah, it would have been our fifth fish. And Losing one at the like boat. Inches, so. Man. Fifth fish, too. So y'all have four fish. All right, guys. Great job out there. Well done. Thanks for participating. We'll see how it goes with the results show. All right, so I'm here with Lamar University. All right, Blaze, we saw you on the water. Uh, we got you actually catching a redfish, which is cool. The only fish that we got on camera today, you, you turned it on right when the camera was there. The right time, man. Yeah, you guys showed up at the right time. Nice. Now, what'd you catch it on? Uh, I caught him on a gulp shrimp, a uh, white shrimp. Uh, all right. All the fish were hanging out there, hanging out right along the pylons. Right. Of all the piers. Awesome, man. And you guys had found some fish there before, or how'd you know to go there? Yeah, we had caught some there yesterday. Okay, cool. Yeah. So pre-fishing can, can certainly pay off. You caught some? I know yeah. I saw you filming with the GoPro. Yeah, uh, caught a few real early. I uh, had a several, probably first hour of the morning I hung and got off at the boat. It was pretty disappointing, but uh, I guess that's part of the game. And luckily, I got all mine early. So. Right. So after that, you're just out there getting a suntan. Sounds that's like it. most of everyone else's day. All right, cool. Well, Lamar University, we'll have to see how it shakes down at the results show. That's it. Cool. Right. Thank you. As the results show begins, it was Lamar University's Dave Roberts who took third place individual with 32 and a half inches. Dave's brother Blaze Roberts, also from Lamar University, took second place with 32 and a half inches and a big fish tiebreaker. And your first ever individual champion is LSU's Shane Pantoya with 33 and a half inches. Making up Lamar University team number one, the Roberts brothers along with Stuart Flowers make their way back to the stage taking third place with 82 and a quarter inches. It was Lamar University team number two, including Ty Harrell, Seth Means, and Alex Soper who claimed second place with 86 and a half inches.
And your Sperry Topsider National Champion is LSU team number three, Shane Pantoya, Ryan Louvet, and Jacob Cormier with 96 and 3 quarter inches. And here are the results for the 2013 Sperry Topsider College Kayak Fishing National Championship. Congratulations to all who participated in this year's season. Big thanks to all of our sponsors, especially Sperry Topsider, Hook One, KayakFishingGear.com, Jackson Kayak, and Mike Pornovitz from Everything Kayak. The game warden behind me and I thought she turned her siren on. I was like, is that really necessary? Like, yeah. <laughs> No, I'm packing a getaway. I mean, as soon as we started catching fish, it flipped on. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's funny. So it really was yeah. like a, a jackpot, honey hole. Then the like two guys were staying.